If the fault log indicates the occurrence of HP fault, carry out the following troubleshooting procedure and identify the cause of the fault. Make following preparations to carry out the troubleshooting procedure. 1. Ensure that the roof of the rail car is accessible. 2. Set the HVAC main control switch to off position. 3. Connect the rail car to shore supply. 4. Identify on TIMS in which circuit the fault has occurred. HP switch 1 is located below the left hand side condenser coil. HP switch 2 is found below the right hand side condenser coil. In normal operation, HP switch is open. It closes when the pressure exceeds the tripping pressure. And 5. Fit the pressure gauges to both discharge and suction ports. and open all service valves. Now carry out the following troubleshooting procedure. First, switch on the HVAC unit to on position and operate the unit in cool to test mode. Monitor the discharge pressure of the faulty circuit. If the HP switch is functioning properly, it should cut in at 334 plus minus 15 psi and it should cut out at 435 plus minus 15 psi. If it does not do so, replace the HP switch and recheck the circuit. If the HP fault is still occurring, check and ensure that the condenser coil is clean. For this, bring the HVAC main control switch to off position and clean the condenser coil of the problematic circuit as is being shown to you. Clean the fins 